We are baking vegan chocolate chip cookies. Wow! I promise you that I have pants on right now. You're probably wondering how do we do that? I'll tell you. With this bad boy right there. We got the recipe. Also, if you're like, ew, what's on your arms? It's eczema. What's that eczema? What's that eczema? <laughs> Okay, so we got the recipe. We went shopping. We got what we needed. We got it. We're in this. Ooh. Buy one, get one. Um, semi sweet mega chunk. Oh my gosh. All purpose flour. Vegan butter. And don't no worry, I got more. I got more. Yeah, a lot more. Y'all thought you were getting out of this one? Oh boy, you don't even know it. Bam! Vanilla. Bam! Baking soda. Bam! Oh my god, I almost just dropped that. Oh my god. Brown sugar. Bam! Normal sugar. Not really. Uh, cane sugar. Uh, instead of white sugar. Would that work? Or should I just use white sugar? I think this would work. What else do we need? Oh! But uh-huh. Are you just sometimes surprised by your own stupidity? Because I really am while editing this, honestly. Bam! Almond milk. Cause that's how we roll. And it tastes so much better than actual milk. And this brand is so good, y'all. Almond milk. I think that's it. Actually, wait, no, there's definitely more. Or maybe not. Shack flour. Oh, cocoa powder. Got that boy boy right here. Check. Vegan chocolate. This is vegan, y'all ain't that crazy? I thought it was crazy. I cannot believe that they even made vegan chocolate. Now it's time to do this the right way. Let's get down to it. Preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius. Well, I live in Florida, so we're gonna do Fahrenheit. I don't know. We're gonna set this somewhere all right 350 degrees all right what was i doing oh step, step two add the vegan butter and brown and white sugar to an electric mixing bowl and cream together add the vanilla and mix in bringing out the big boy i don't need this anymore <gasps> wait but look at how cute this is it's a little cat and it looks like my cat i think it's so cute sugar to an electric mixing bowl and cream together add the vanilla and mix in okay so we got we got the big mixing bowl and we need half a cup of vegan butter yo last time me and my sister got in like a debate of like what type of measuring cups you use if it's a liquid or a solid because i swear there's a difference and let's just say the cookies cookies turn out <laughs> y'all all right so half a cup of vegan butter Bon appetit. What the heck? Uh, out of it. Oh my gosh. Half a cup of brown and white sugar. I don't know what the difference is. I mean, I don't know like what, like why you have to have both. In this recipe, I really don't, but um. Like why can't you just have one type that you use? I don't know. I'm rambling here. I don't know. Yay! Get crazy. Get wild. Let's party. Get loud. If you want to have fun, to do something. Next. So we're done with this bad boy. White sugar. Cane sugar is like white sugar. Yeah. It'll work. Worst case is it is awful. And I spent all this money on these ingredients for nothing. <laughs> That's just life, baby. That's just life, darling. What the fuck? And now I cream them all together. Whatever that means. I ain't no British baking show woman. Who can say where the road goes? Ah, ah. Okay, how much? Ah, there's like so much sugar on the ground now and I'm stuck. 
stepping in it and I hate it. Okay, how much vanilla? One teaspoon. Oh my gosh. When I was younger, I would like try and eat vanilla. Ugh, extract because to me it like smelled so good. And I would eat it and then I'd just instantly like hate every choice I've ever made in life. Not when I was like seven. And cocoa powder into a mixing bowl and mix in the cookie. Uh, mm. How did they graduate high school, y'all? And mix in the baking soda and the salt. Gotta do another bowl. Ooh, I'm using. Okay. Isn't that so cute? He sings whenever he's done preheating. I think it is adorable. One the cup. And this is of that quantity. It's like about a cup. Yeah! I was supposed to sift. Eh. What does baking soda do? Couldn't tell ya. Could not for the life of it tell ya. We don't want to. We want our, our cookies to be salty, but just a little bit salty. You know, just like, just like me. I'm a little bit salty, perfect amount of salt. Sometimes I'm extra salty, you never know though. Let me get you all a little aerial view right now. So that's the dry ingredients. That's the recipe. This is my mess. Sorry, mom. This is the wet ingredients. Oh, that's me. I just want to mix them together so that way it's more even and mixes together with the wet ingredients better. That's my final verdict and you have to live with that because you just watched this video, so I'm sorry. Good, good technique. Just dump it in there. Oh, this feels really soft, actually. Wow. Oh, I'm excited. Ooh. I'm so pumped for this. Oh my gosh. My neighbors can probably hear me. They probably think I'm an idiot. But what else is new? Add the one tablespoon of non-dairy milk. It's your time to shine, my little almond milk. Say anything else, so mix them by hand again. I'm really not gonna mix it in, I just clean my hands again. Oh, the agony and the mess! Oh, the mess! Roll them into a little bowl. He's kind of big, so. Oh, you're rolling. Talk time is stupid. All right. They're in. Oh, it's hot. Now we just wait 10 minutes. done girl i am ready to eat these should i touch it okay i'm gonna let them cool down obviously because i am a professional baker and i know that you have to let things cool down before you do anything with them or you can mess them up so we're just gonna let them cool down for like a couple minutes and in the meantime your girl is gonna make herself a cup of coffee because she has not had any all day. She's been up since 7 a.m. working out, making cookies. I am tired, so I'm gonna make some coffee. Beautiful little babies. And, girl, I just brewed myself a fresh, very hot pot of coffee. I'm so ready. My nails are so dirty. That's not dirt. It's the cookie stuff. I'm so sorry. 
But girl, I'm so ready. Got my little Christmas mug for my coffee. We're gonna try one of these cookies because they're pretty cool now. They smell so good and chocolatey. I'm so ready. And I'm just gonna pour myself a nice cup of coffee, just a little bit. Cause I'm trying to cut back on the caffeine. <laughs> I'm also trying to cut back on dairy, and this, I'm pretty sure, has dairy in it. Oh, it's lactose-free, non-dairy. Could be sweeter, but I feel like the cookies are going to be so sweet that I don't need it to be any sweeter. It's not Christmassy. I wish it was, but it's not. Okay, I'm going to try this one at the end. Oh my gosh, these smell so good. Moment of truth time. Is this going to be the world's best vegan cookie? on the entire planet in the universe in the yeah in the universe i was gonna say something else but i think that's as far as it goes well let me go for this corner right here three two fun no it's good <laughs> that is so good this is one of the best cookies i've ever eaten in my entire life oh my god a little dry but the flavor is so good really chug this coffee to counteract that sweetness oh my gosh it's so good wow final verdict this is the bomb.com this is amazing this is awesome oh my gosh so good literally so good it's like it reminds me of these types of cookies that my friend made like three years ago and i ate them and i was like that's the best cookie i've ever had this reminds me of them but just chocolatier gosh so freaking delicious i'm proud of myself well that is literally all that i have for you today um bake this literally go go right now to the store buy these ingredients i had like majority of the ingredients already at my house except for like four things Go and make these. These are amazing. This is literally, if you are trying to step up your baking game, I'm so pumped right now. If you're trying to step up your baking game at Christmas this year, which I know I am, bake these cookies. Oh my gosh, amazing. Inclusive for everyone. Anyone will like this. Amazing, perfect, wonderful, fantastic, uh, amazing. Um, I think I already said that, but I'm gonna say it again, wonderful. Great, super good is you combine two words together. Yeah, so that's it. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, bake these cookies, bake them. And if you make a video of you baking them, link it down below so I can watch it because I like watching other people's videos of them baking. Like, you know how moms live through their kids through pageants because they can be a pageant kid? That's what I do by watching people bake. Um, I live through them and watching them bake and eat really good food. That's why the Food Network is one of my favorite channels. No lie. Yeah, so be sure to like this video and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this because let's be real, I love to bake things like this, so I'm probably gonna be making more baking videos. Baking! So have a great rest of your day. I hope you guys make this cookie because it's great and if you don't, then you're missing out on a lot of stuff. Bye!